Enjoy this episode. We'll talk about our journey to finding our RV. So we went on our first RV tour and this first one that we saw, oh my gosh, it was amazing. We absolutely fell in love with it. It had like pretty much everything we wanted, but you know, the price was a little higher than we wanted. <laughs> so although we liked it, we didn't get it. So we left and we started seeing RVs everywhere. <laughs> I mean, everywhere. So, of course, that means we went to another RV place and we had to look at some more RVs. And so, we saw this big old RV. It was a little old looking for us, but it did have a lot of the stuff in it that we liked. So, we're like, let me put this on my wish list. Let me add this to my wish list. You know, we saw some things we already liked. So, we're refining our RV wish list after seeing that beautiful diesel pushing beauty. We leave. Man, we see more RVs everywhere. So we went to another RV store. (laughs) And we look at this new RV and we're like, you know what? This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. And it was gas. So that meant I can have fire to cook. I'm still a gas girl when it comes to cooking. These electric stoves ain't for me. So we had the itch. It had to be scratched. That wasn't the one for us, but we kept looking. So we looked at that one. We looked at some other ones. We were all over the place looking at RVs. We were like, we got to find our RV, right? So here's another one that we go and see. And I mean, this is nice, right? This is really nice. It pretty much has everything we needed again. I think there were some things that we were like yay and nay about, but for the most part, it was absolutely fabulous. Uh, It had an ironing board in there that was different. We hadn't seen that anywhere. (laughs) The room was nice. It was a little cramped. I mean, we're in an RV. We expect cramped, but it was just a little more cramped than we liked. And we decided not this one. But we had our wish list finished. It was long and we were ready. So we went back to Lazy Days. We had been here before, but we needed to go again. And they introduced me to this one. So this is a 2021 J. Cole Precept. It's black and cream. 39 feet. And we're gonna go in now. Oh, here's the storage down here. You got one, two, three, four. The water stuff. This is the black holding tank and the gray water tank. And low point drain, unleaded fuel only, more tank. We got a ladder on the back. more storage down here it has three slides there's the awning an outdoor tv now let's go in it was disgusting and i was like how dare you (laughs) but he convinced me to get off the rv clear my mind and get back in and check it out and grab my wish list at the same time and it actually you know had everything we were looking for except for a freaking dishwasher but other than that it had everything we were looking for and it was kind of like yo if they clean this joint up we can do this hey there's me (laughs) so we were really able to look at this rv with a clear head and our wish list in front of us and we saw that It met our needs for the most part. It's a great starter RV. Like I wouldn't have opted for a washer and dryer combo, but it it was a washer and dryer. If we wash every single day, we'll have clean clothes, right? (laughs) So looking at it, it's like, you know what? We could do this. We could totally do this. And 
everybody was on board. We were sold. But it was a lot of mess in there because the previous owners were nasty. So, <laughs> so they made some upgrades for us. They took out those seats. The seats were all scratched up from the animals that lived in here before. I mean, there was freaking kibbles and bits on the table when I did the walkthrough. <laughs> it was a mess in there. There was a beer can in there. It was so nasty. So they gutted the whole thing, reupholstered all the seats, and then did some sterry cleaning and tried to get all the cat hair and dog hair out. They failed, but they did their best. So I was pleased. And, you know, I went to go see it again, see what we had going on. And when they finished, I mean, look at these seats now. <laughs> they look nice, right? There's no scratches on them. It's brand new for my family. They did a pretty decent job. But there was a few more things we had to jump through. So this is our Equinox. And let me tell you something. So we are here at the RV place. There is our SUV and we are selling this joint. We're trading it in. So we are now down to just our minivan. This? this is just recording. Got my uh, plate off, keys, handed everything in. So yeah, we're gonna turn it. We turned, this, turned the SUV in as a trade-in. And now we are getting ready to go sign the papers on our RV. Yeah! Boys, are you guys excited? Uh, yes. Oh. Yeah. Man, that was weak. Um, We're going to sign the papers for our RV. Are you excited? Yes, I am. Bowie. Bowie? Yeah. Okay, and there's Daddy. I'm excited as well. It's been a long time coming. We had a lot of obstacles and challenges. But through the grace of God, we have overcome and overcame every single one of them. On that note, I gotta drive and I'm out of gas. Peace. Here at Lazy Days, going to go sign our paperwork. So we're going in. We had to wait, so we decided to eat. And sing. <laughs> and then the signing began. There were tons of papers for us to fill out. We were in this little teeny office with our three kids. It, Trey was doing the video, as you can see. Trey has a different way of doing videotaping. He is special. <laughs> but we signed the papers. And this was April 23rd. And it was ours. And our kids were so good. Like, we're so proud of them, you know? And then we left. There's our SUV. Wait, is that it? It was bittersweet to see the vehicle we brought in as we left. But hey, this is what we own now. This is our baby. And we're so proud of our new home on wheels, as our four year old calls it. <laughs> And here's my hubby going in with some stuff looking like Santa for the very first time. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Make sure you like, comment, and share. And don't forget to hit the bell for notifications.